Gotsukun being up on the stage, I'm glad he made it out. Same with Ryukichi. Had a little bit of a rough start, in my opinion. Dude, where are these? Where are they getting these? How are they making these? Are they like, making them? Making it themselves? Because it's also it looks very similar to the Momochi one. I don't know if that's like the same girl that's throwing up the signs mm -hmm. too, but very very impressive. I would be surprised if they like making them at home and like bring them here to support the uh, players. Yeah. You know, yeah. Dude, these guys can draw. I love. So we've seen those too. The little uh, square blockhead like plush yeah. toys. I thought they were like. I thought they would be like maybe little like paper things you could put on their desk or whatever, but they're full on plush toys. They're full on plush toys. Oh. I did not know that. It, you know when we we see them, I, I think over in League, like the advertisements. Yeah, that was like they, the they first. They look like half. they're a little bit more like, I guess like paper, like or like cardboard or something like that. Yeah. yeah, but that looks like it's a full on one. So that is super sick to see the support and again the merch and all the great things that are happening over in Land Japan. They really love their Street Fighter and they love their players too as well. And I like to see them give that love to the reverence of what's going on. And as there's a lot of reverence out here, two spots will be taken today as we start eliminating some of these players. Fudo's already out. We'll see what happens mm -hmm. between Gachikun and Ryukichi. They'll set us up for even more action later on. That's insane, man. man. Fudo being out too. Mans cannot catch a break, but I think he's still really? gonna be active in World Warrior no matter what. Mm -hmm. All right, Gachikun, Ryukichi, how do you feel about this match? Uh, Gachikun, been, he's been on fire. In regards to like the matchups between like all the other Ken players in Street Fighter League, he's been you know decimating all of them. But Ryukichi's always been like the diamond in the rough, in my opinion, and for a lot of the commentators here too. I think Ryukichi, Ryukichi gives a lot of different looks in regards to how he moves right. into like baiting people, into throwing out normals, and is also very, very strong with the whiff punish game. I'm so glad these guys are singing to the song too, <laughs> and I'm glad they're letting the intros rock. But yeah, I think Ryukichi does a really great job of applying more pressure than damage. Mm -hmm. uh, one of those big instances is off of the Dragon Lash, he'll opt for the double dash forward instead of going for any sort of damage ender a lot of the time. And that's also been taken akin to a lot of the players in the US. They've type, sort of taken to that strategy as of late for good reason, right? You just get so much out of that. Definitely makes sense. Ryukichi also a type to really make a combo video out of everybody that he fights. Like if you whip a bad DP, he'll make something look real nasty. So like he that. moves. Yes, sir. Exactly what we prefaced with, right? Ryukichi just has a different type of standard in regards to what his game plan is for netting this damage and then these very, very opportunistic moments. Double counter combo. He's able to look for the crouching needle kick, gets a knockdown. Over the throw. Ryukichi texts and snipes out with the crouching needle kick. Yeah, easy kill had more to take if need be off that crouch fears. Ryukichi, one round so far. Very, com very, very dominant round. He did the prepare against the fireball, which is like the establishment tool Sick. for Gachakun, but right there, Gachakun switches it up. I love the fact that he reacted to the whirlwind shot with crouching medium punch. Mm -hmm. I love seeing those trades against the fireball. Also, damn, that was actually oh. pretty expensive for Gachakun to get stuffed out. Yeah. Gets a level two Isar, though. I think the primary objective, obviously, to apply pressure, but it also allows Gachakun to regain some of his gauge. Damn, that was actually kind of rough. So get the pickup. Wasn't able to do so, but unfortunately, Ryukichi autopilots. So yeah, the confirm. OD. Frame kill backs away for a little bit. Yeah, I like that. Block low. That could have been a lot more. That could have been a side switch, but Gachakun will take it off of this, I do believe. Got that level one for the follow up. Yes, sir. So Rashid kick. I'll show you what a real SRK looks like. Ooh. I'm so glad they call it Super Rashid kick. I see you, Capcom. Yeah. You guys are real smart. Common Rider vibes. I like that. Stand medium kick now as the adjustment tool gets the crouching medium punch from Ryukichi. Looking like Dual Kevin. You said Ryukichi was looking like Dual Kevin? Oh, no, no. Gotcha. Okay, I was That's like, stand medium kick. Oh, okay. Yeah. I was like, wait, huh? Threw me, uh, threw me for a loop. I was like, is, is Kevin playing Ken now? I was like, no way. Oh, no. There's no. Yeah, I mean, either. Oh, Burnout City. That mixer. Go for level one. Oh, yeah. He knew that for days. Help Perry. Gains a little bit more bar than usual. The Super Rashid kick, is that even necessary? Oh, 100% is necessary. Oh. Did it matter? Okay, I was going to say, like, I think there was a moment for him to actually get the level one and, and, and kill off, but seeing Ryukichi and Burnout, I don't think there was much for Gachika to really worry about. A two bars left? Yeah. Not Isar could be coming through. Yeah. Could even do, you could even do that to Cyclone if you did. Gachika with the first victory. Early knocked off the OP. Uh -oh. This time goes for nothing, calls out the old DP. Do a lot this team. Ryukichi has spent so much time on the far end of the screen. Finally, does get the opener off of the low medium kick he's been searching for the whole time. Yeah, the other oh, side. Oh, we get rewarded with throw. the back throw upon wake up from Gachikun. All that work for nothing. Gachikun is operating on some different levels right now. 
Can't whirlwind. Dashes up instead of trying to do the mixer on the way through. The switch up. I do like that, yeah. And that I like him using more like the OD gauges in general, like the OD fireball too, as right. well, to like just establish more of the neutral. We get harder for you to go for this perfect parry. It's level two. My win condition coming through. Help. No, he tried to go for the back throw. And look at your reward. Half your health gone. Interrupts the driver with the stand. Fierce the stop sign. Oh, this hurts. Get the sky high. Gets the mix. The safe jump trade. That could have been so much worse. Ryukichi fighting for his life, too. Just one more instance, he gets a fierce, but nothing backed behind it other than a fireball. That's kind of rough. I mean, I ran into the tornado head first. Oh, I thought we were going to get the Jon Jonathan Kent ending, but no, it's going to be the overhead. <laughs> Dachikun up two games. Looking pretty confident. Ryukichi could the nerve be playing a factor. He's been getting a lot of free damage on the board against him from, from uh, Dachikun's rolling shots. I think that's like the problem here. It's like you want to establish that cool Twitter clip stuff that you do, those cool combos that you have with Ken that are like really, I feel like, you teach exclusives. But Gachikun is stuffing and stopping this with staying medium punch. He's got the proper tools to stop crouching medium punch like as an initiator. He's just disallowing what Ryukichi is known for. Here we go. As soon as I say that, the heavy kick and has Toxin Ender. Oki up in the corner. Punish counter throw. Ryukichi starting to wake up. Nice. He backed off enough for that deep DP to hit. Oh, stuffing out the charge whirlwind shot. Ryukichi within range for the fears. Level one, not going to be enough. Set up with the fireball. Of course. More touch. More free damage. He's just running into the whirlwind shots again. Again and again. Should we go for toe tap? I'm not sure. Cannot jump in on like the gotcha game, especially at that distance. The ODBP being able to clean the space, but on the ground, he's down. The stand light kick. Very safe and solid option right there. Ryukichi. Getting that lead and keeping that lead. Oh, okay. I like that. Finally taking note of the spacing between him and Gajakun when he wants to use those medium kicks. Finally paying off. Yep, stay in that pocket. Jump back medium punch to keep Gajakun contained in the corner. Usually, Hale is having the best defense in the game. Gajakun is getting exposed right now. Up until this point, taking a big risk, and boy, does it pay off. It doesn't allow him to get his level two set up because he did have to spend level one, right? That's true. Back the fireball game this time. The OD gets the eagle spike right after. Mix up. You better guess right. You guess wrong. Hold extra damage on the punch counter. Purple parry is there. Should be able to get a side switch here. No, he's gonna go for what? I don't know what that was. Maybe he thought I can't go for the light kick. Follow up for the level three. Uh, he miscalculated too. Much? Run oh DP to my the god! Yes, sir, are you kidding me? This guy, Ryukichi. He got Sit it. Sit down and shut up. Oh my god! He he told you, bro. He's like, hey man. You said I couldn't get any Twitter clips going? Bet. That was it. <laughs> He's like, you, you thought that I couldn't get any Twitter clips going? He told, he's telling all of us to sit down and shut up, I feel like. Got it, Yukichi. So on TikTok. now we understand like the the, uh, the intent behind some of these runs, right? But mm -hmm. like Gachikun, I feel like it's just been too far away for some of the run DPs to even connect from the side of Yukichi. But I guess like him having the threat of it is, like, I guess, enough. Gachikun might have been stumped. See how that operates, though. Rikichi, I thought like has to have like a significant lead for these things to work Ooh. out though. Does get the sweet knockdown. Uh, Street Fighter 4 style, right? Cross mm -hmm. I swear if that hit, <laughs> I got got once on a World Warrior recap. I'm not getting got again. Not again. The range is there for it actually. Okay, we're gonna get the pre combo going into it. But it's gonna be kind of tough. The back dash to bait out the throw. And you know, I understand the risk behind it. Rikichi really wanted that back throw. It does lead to a lot. It does lead to a lot of momentum for specifically Ken mm -hmm. being able to get that pocket against Gachikun, medium kick, counter hit. Hold up. OD on the dry rush up. Another one, sneaks in the crouching light kick, as it with the medium mixer. The drive impact, get a little bit too risky. Too medium greedy for that corner carry or corner lead. I don't know what that was. I don't know either. I know this is bad. You're in burnout. Not on the options, you got level one, but it's weighted and baited. You're decimated. Gachakun with the old the expenditure to be able to kill. Perfect KO to send Ryukichi out of the tournament. However, there are some great moments of Ryukichi. For him to get this far was fantastic, but this guy's a whirlwind. He puts the win in whirlwind? Is that what you're trying to tell me? I think so. Gachakun. He has a defense up. at the end of it, too? This guy's good. This guy's really good. Spars. I'm just kidding. Uh, it's, I'm actually kind of surprised that it went down in, in this fashion. I don't think it was like that far apart the last time they played, but seeing mm. it 